but we still can. Is that the placenta up above there? Mm hmm. That is, yeah. Oh, he's got a nice nut muzzle, Tom. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow, yeah. <laughs> Not my Can son. What's yeah. going on here? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's great. Yeah, let's give him a thumbs up. <laughs> Because everyone's like, oh yeah, you'd think you'd feel triplets more kicking, but they so no, they kick you each other. No, you how tiny they are well, too yeah. at this point, but eventually. Well, so yeah, they have to get strong enough that you can actually feel. But and it depends on how active they are. There's people that have to twitch and like, you know, you don't hear them say it's the babies, and then you hear people say, oh my gosh, these babies never stop moving. Yeah. I hope they do. But except they're gonna. Kick you in the stomach. I know. That's what I. But so I've, you know, so I was reading when you have one baby. Standing up. <laughs> stretch it out. Anywhere yeah. they kick, they're kicking you. But with three, some of the time they're kicking each other. So um, you're not necessarily yeah. getting all the extra, like, kicks. And my friend who'd had twins, she was saying once they get big enough. They'll kick the food right out of your stomach, you know, because they uh, start. Hers were. She had a huge twins. Did she? Yeah, they ended up being like each almost eight pounds. Oh my gosh. That's really uncomforting, though, you know, to mm -hmm. have babies that big. But mm -hmm. she did like a, a natural birth too, which is not. 